A dog found starved and abandoned in East Grand Rapids is getting better at an animal hospital. The dog, now named Hope, was rescued Friday by neighbors who spotted the dog collapsed in the middle of the road. 13 on your side's Carla Byron joining us now from the newsroom with our continuing coverage. And Carla, you did learn today there is an open police investigation now. Juliet Kirk, a detective with the East Grand Rapids Police Department, tells me they'll be turning this case over to Kent County Animal Control since they typically investigate animal cruelty cases. A warning to those watching, these pictures may be disturbing for some. The latest we know about Hope is she's in critical condition, but is showing progress. She's weak and isn't able to walk much, but she is drinking and can lift her head. The East Grand Rapids Police Department have opened an investigation. Appear to be maybe some, some marks on her face, um, some, some injury, but nothing that would lead us to believe that uh, the dog was hit by a car. Hope was just skin and bones when she was found Friday morning on Lakeside Drive Southeast in East Grand Rapids. Emily Bond's husband was walking his dogs when he saw her lying in the middle of the road. She is very emaciated, just starved in bad condition, her skin, um, her ribs, I mean, the poor thing, she just, she doesn't look good. Neighbors brought her food and water, and one person took her to a nearby animal hospital for treatment. Staff there suspects she was used as a breeding dog, as it looks as though she had a lot of litters and then was abandoned. The detective says there was evidence Hope had clearly been injured and mistreated. I have a dog, I, I love my dog, and I would, I would never, I, I just, I can't imagine why someone would do this when they could um, offer the dog up to, uh, for adoption. They could call a vet, they could bring the dog to a vet, they could call animal control, they could come to any police department, um, they could reach out for help and this person uh, did not. The detective says they'll be turning the case over to Kent County Animal Control since they typically investigate animal cruelty cases. There are still a lot of unknowns. It is possible that the dog wandered in from another area. Uh, the dog was found in East Grand Rapids, but that doesn't mean that the abuse, neglect actually was occurring in East Grand Rapids. Um, it, it, it possibly could have happened elsewhere in Kent County. What is known is Hope is now getting the attention and love she deserves. Her GoFundMe has raised more than $18,000. This is up from 15,000 yesterday. If anyone has any information, you can contact the police department, animal control, or silent observer. In the newsroom, Carla Byron 13 on your side.